So we are at IKEA in Manchester at the moment. We literally just arrived. So we're going to pick up some items for the seller, some upcoming projects um, for the guest room and bits and bobs. Um, I also want to check out what's new. Um, usually in January, they release sales and new items. So I'm interested to see what they got. Um, I also was thinking to create a console In table for yards, the... Your destination will be on the left. Um, actually, I'm already here. <laughs> right, I forgot to turn this off. Um, right, quickly. Uh, okay, so yeah, where was I? Um, yeah, so we're gonna get bits and bobs. I already been here a couple of weeks ago um, when my parents were here and actually bought quite a lot of furniture that I haven't unboxed yet. So when we got everything all together, we're gonna unbox it at the end of this video um, to sh show you guys what I got today and the week before. Um, quite a lot of projects in the line. So yeah, let's go. I not ate anything, but I definitely don't wanna eat anything here. So anyway, let's go. You know what I realized, Carl? What's that? That through the years, you actually become a um, Ikea fan, I remember how much you hated coming here before. Oh, yeah, big fan. I don't need drawers. Yeah, but you're excited to come now. You said that. Oh, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. Definitely not. Yeah. Oh, I like this little black thing. Don't you like it? Is it? I think it's just a race. But anyway, it looks nice and pretty. Huh? This is new as well, this candle. Actually have it in glass, see through. And these little green green ones. These are pretty. You should get something like this for your cellar. If you put them in the right thing, they look pretty like that. No? These yeah. are the little cubicles that you want, don't you? No, I want a straight one. What do you mean, straight one? Oh, like a bookcase with tilt the sideways. Yeah, but what if it can't fit in? You should have measured it. Okay. We need some pictures here. With extra gravy, as he always asks for extra gravy. I got some the salmon and mozzarella cheese and the fruitful. We also got one of these because we absolutely love this. We got this for a few times now, so we're trying a new flavor. So this is our breakfast, literally. Ooh. Excited? Excited for soup. Is there a soup? No. I thought it's gravy. It is gravy. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some of these green ones and these stony ones. Kind of like a shiny texture on them. They also have black, um, white, blue down there and some pink color combination over there. Um, but I think we're gonna go with these. So, should I get these? Oh, this is the area I like the most, with all the storage things. They have now luggages, look. That, yeah, that wasn't a thing before, was it? Yeah, I think so either. Alright, let's have a look because this is where I also need some stuff. Some stuff. I like the floor lamp so much with that little breast things. 
Well, I have the, this one at home in my office, the smaller one. I like the little breasts, they're so nice and shiny. They have on sale a Riva, the smallest one, so we're gonna grab a few of these. Oh, that's so good. Sit down right now. This is so cool. You like it? Marvelous. A little bit tacky. <laughs> yeah. So cool. Oh. Ooh, look romantic lights. Look, you can you can change the color. Oh, you have to hold it. It's not really changing. Maybe it's wrong. Oh, now they have a new area. These are very pretty. Wait for spring with all these color combinations. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh. Oopsie. I don't know, guys, what you think, but I absolutely love this area. Probably my favorite area in IKEA. I love those. Uh, so pretty. Love the tiny bit of gold detail. That bike is so cool. I quite have quite a lot of these in my house, and I don't actually own any plant um, that is actually alive. I all have all these different sort of plants in the house. I actually haven't got anything from IKEA. Maybe we should look around for some of those. These are new because they were in here. It's very pretty. I like the detail on one now. To be honest, I was wanted to look at the world. Huh? You can do it, you want. Did you not, not change the size? Yeah, right guys, so we are going to get some mirror um, for the gas room. So we are downstairs in this uh, warehouse area. We have some really big and nice uh, mattresses, you know. Ooh. What did I say, 54? It's so weird that look, the single and the standard size, the European and the British is two different one. So crazy. I will do need some of these for my next project. Oh. No, they look like they do them in blue as well. What's up? You got it. 54. I don't think that's the right one. It's supposed to be long. Not here. Maybe that one down there? Why, You're enjoying your hot dogs. Mm -hmm. Alright, guys, so we are done here. Um, and now I'm guessing Carl wants a five guys milkshake. Yes, please. Um, 
and after we will be heading home um, and I'm gonna be unboxing everything what we got together and I also have a few items like I mentioned I already um, got last time we were here so I'm gonna show everything for you guys and yeah a few things I couldn't get what I wanted because they're still out of stock I can't believe it um, there is the Billy unit Augsburg doors that I've been trying to chase like for half year now um, and they still out of stock and it says that it's gonna be back next week and yeah maybe we're gonna be come back next week <laughs> yeah <laughs> not excited about that trip now yeah. I mean you need the shelves as well for the sellers so maybe it's a good shout is it okay good chat Ooh, this is the second day now um i'm filming this video because um actually after we finished and ikea we went to five guys cal also loves the milkshake um so every time we go there um we have to pop in to get him a milkshake they have bacon bacon milkshake obviously he hasn't got that one yet i think one day i'm gonna surprise him to see what it's actually like because i'm really interested to see who the hell drinks a bacon milkshake ah, it sounds disgusting but anyway so now we are back i'm gonna show you guys what i managed to get um i haven't got everything that i wanted i've been hunting for these augsburg doors for downstairs for the living room for so long they said it's gonna be back on stock next week uh back in stock next week however they said this in december around christmas time and when i went in um i only need the four doors and when i went in literally there was one left so i didn't buy that um yeah anyway so i'm hoping to get that i'm also thinking to get some uh, clothes rail and things like that so i think we're gonna be back next week um uh, either monday or tuesday um, we also need to buy some shelves for downstairs for the cellar so the cellar refurbishment is stopped for the past two weeks um, it's only plastering painting that needs to be done then everything can go in where it needs to be um, so we split the cellar into two um, different rooms and I'm so excited to show you that Oi, you can't feed their cookie yeah okay um yeah so let's take you guys and see what we got <sighs> right so i think the first thing i'm gonna show you is actually the the trip that i actually went to ikea a few weeks ago like i said back in december i got a few bits and bobs for this room let me just get some lighting because it is terrifying here all right i love these little rails ah! and you probably saw it from the previous video what i done with that um unit so yeah what we got here is an absolute mess right <laughs> okay so we got okay so let's get these oh! okay you don't break anything so these are the three pound i think they are three pound or two pound fifty shelves they called the what is it called they have such a weird names on they um burl burholt or something like that so um these are uh, the little shelves that i'm gonna be playing with in this room so we got about eight of those if not more we got some lamps for the whole white that i'm gonna be um making like a little diy i think i'm gonna paint these so they are plastic so most likely i will be using chalk paint on these they call the melody they were only around five pound each we got some isfred um cushions basically to fill um this room with nice cushions so we got some covers this is gonna be matching with that color and um, we also got some beige ones over there this is called the sunila um i think yeah this is on the same range so it's like a nice 
um, velvet. Um, I don't like crushed velvet, so we got this nice super soft uh, velvet. Um, these are some um, curtains for downstairs, but they're not from Ikea, so I just put these there here. Um, what else we got here? Obviously, every single time I go to Ikea, ooh, a little bit broke, but we will fix that. Um, I buy these little boxes called Yena or Tanya. Um, I got this rug. I think it was about 20 pounds or 30 pounds or something-ish. It's not like a, an extreme proper rug so it's like has this kind of thick um material but also not too thick so i just want this in the middle in this room when everything is done so yeah we got these <sighs> a little chocolate um then we got for what is it called it's called the ring stuff it's a lampshade um it looks exactly like that this is for diy as well um for this room so here more of those shelves that i mentioned previously and then let me just pop you right here we got a two of these a besta draw insides so they are actually like health drawers done so it's missing the front um i got two of these because i have a project that i'm working on in this room um and basically i just need it for that um so we got two of these then we got here two bedside tables which is from the range called colin um as you can see so the front is like that and that's gonna be a nice you know, off-cycle DIY because I also love IKEA furnitures. However, I don't like to place them in the house how they are. I wanna make them unique. I wanna make them, make them matching with the house and things like that. So, and the very last one, it's um, actually dresser drawer. It's one of the newest range that they have. It's quite heavy, so I'm not gonna be able to get to it, but I will pop it into the side right here. Um, which one I got. It was quite cheap. It was about 30 pound-ish. So let's go downstairs. Um, it looks like the whole room actually moved this. Right. So let's get some lights on. So what we got. Uh, here we are. So I only just put these here. What we got from Ikea basically. I got these Pruta tubs. This is for prepping meals. I have uh, I have quite a lot of um, plastic boxes like these from Ikea and I just need this one smaller one so I got this. It was a pound for free, quite good. Then we got four, um, it's like a nice light ivory or beige color and it's like glazed so it's a little bit shiny. We got four of these. Probably I'm gonna pop in and get two more because I like the six sets. Then we got a little bit like a nice texture, but it's not a glazed one. So it's like a sort of a matte, um, the same range. What is it called? Does it have a name? Um, no, just made in Thailand. Um, yeah. So this is like a nice earthy color and the two, it just, I absolutely love it. So it's gonna look so nice on the shelves, I think. Then I got actually two of these, but Carl broke one of them just before we went in um, to the checkout. <laughs> so I ended up with one. And what is it called? Does it have a name? No, it was £1.25. And I also love it. They have this, I think in, in more colors, if I remember right, but maybe I'm mistaken. But this is um, a new item in IKEA and also so of these. Um then this was on sale so they had um these from two pound for one pound or one pound fifty um and I also love it it's so cute it's just 10 centimeter times 10, 10 centimeter I have no idea where I'm gonna put these um or what I'm gonna do with them but I'm sure we will figure out something for these then my also favorite is this Lunas mirror so i was waiting for this to come back in stock in manchester for so long oh my god so so long so finally we got them and um, i got my hands on 
quite a lot I think it was eight because I have an idea to do uh, with these so this mirror probably you saw this mirror on my youtube channel when I made it um, and I'm used the same I should really really clean this and the house is a mess right now because we're doing so many rooms right now but um, I'm using the same um, Luna's one pound mirrors how cute is it it's just one pound these mirrors so yeah very happy with that and we got here two it's called the Frebro Frebro um, this is also a mirror so I will place it like this so you can see me haha <laughs> um, yeah so I got this um, I actually got two of these um, again I have a DIY project in um, my mind for this so we got that too and um, it's also gonna be going into the guest room so I think it's like 20 centimeter times 100 120 oh I'm almost almost got it so yeah uh, we got two of these as well um, and that's all we got I think um, yeah and the only thing is not here is actually already be put downstairs into the cellar it's an Alex uh, unit uh, which is under goes like a desk and stuff like that so that's what we got for Cal already he had one so he needed another one um yeah I think that's all we got for this trip but like I said we will be back next week um I don't know if you guys want to see that video as well so let me know in the comment below but yeah I think it was a successful trip even though I'm still hunting for those Augsburg doors um, but I have high hopes that I'm gonna finally get them um, yeah I'm really happy what I got so far like I said I do do quite a lot of DIYs with them so I don't really tend to leave them how they are of course the mugs and things like that I don't really touch but yeah so that's it for today guys i really hope you enjoyed this video let me know in the comment below if you want to see more vlogs and diys or what kind of videos we would like to see on my channel and hope to see you in my next one thank you for watching bye